immunotherapy is clearly uh, a great thing because it's shown that it can uh, provide complete and durable responses to cancer patients. Um, so literally the, you know, the tumors melt away and they don't come back. Um, so I mean that's, that's really been a, a dream of everyone in the field for a long time and it's, it's really become a reality in certain patients. Um, and you know, I think the field has really kind of turned a, turned a corner now and we're seeing it today and at this meeting this week, um, which is that it's, it's no longer about does immunotherapy work. I think the, the findings and the careful clinical studies and all the work um, over the past years have really shown that and I think everyone's accepted that now, um, that it works and it can work really well in, in some patients. So we've really, at this meeting, I feel we've turned a corner and a lot of the uh, presentations and talks are about, okay, how do, we, how do we expand on this? How do we use it in, in more different types of cancer? How do we combine it to make it work even better? Um, so it's just a really exciting, uh, exciting thing to, to watch that and be a part of that. I mean, uh, first of all, I think, I think it's important to note that, that CITSI has really been on the, on the forefront of this whole, um, you know, this whole move towards immunotherapy. And you know, when, when I got involved with the organization, it was sort of before um, you know, all the uh, public attention and all that, and it was really just a group of incredibly smart people who are incredibly dedicated to this goal of producing complete and durable responses by harnessing the immune system to, uh, to get rid of cancer. And, you know, everyone, and, and CITSI was really the organization that pulled all those folks together um, through the annual meeting and, you know, through various other meetings and um, events and information. Um, so, I think because of that history, CITSI's really sort of grown and, and, you know, as these great clinical results have come out and immunotherapy is really um, being recognized widely for its, its ability to create these complete and durable responses, I think CITSI's really done a good job of, of having the, the annual meeting that, that brings in a lot of the leaders in the field and the people that created the field, literally. Um, and so I think the annual meeting is, is key. I know there are a number of other sessions that CITSI does that provide a lot of great information. And it, it's just, I think, because the, the leaders in the field and the people that created these therapies are involved with CITSI, they're in the leadership, they come to uh, all the events, it, it's really sort of a central, central organization for, for this field. I think uh, it's, it's just really exciting because there's, uh, you know, there's a lot of work now to take immunotherapies and try them in different types of cancer to combine them with other therapies and really figure out, um, okay, now we, we know we can get a complete and durable response in some patients. How do we make that happen in every patient How, and, and in patients with different types of cancer? So it's really, um, I think going forward and over the next couple of years, it's really going to be about that sort of expansion and uh, you know, finding out how to help as many patients as possible.